With hours to go for the final voting, the election race between Kamala Harris and Donald Trump is too narrow and too close to call. More than 75 million Americans have already cast their ballot in early voting. This has been a vitriolic campaign. We've seen how Donald Trump has taken a very harsh stand on immigration that has worried Americans and people across the world as well. He's also gone on to call Democrats a bunch of cheats. People are voting in large numbers because they're also worried about a repeat of the violence that we had seen in Capitol Hill after Donald Trump lost the elections. Both leaders are now campaigning in the battleground states to appeal to the remaining undecided voters. Harris at 49 percentage points is just one point ahead of Donald Trump in overall national polls. Neither of the candidates has enough leads to be able to claim 270 electoral votes, which is the magic number. There is still a chance that Trump may win this election. In 2016 and 2020, he had outperformed the opinion polls in key swing states. And when it comes to the US election, it is the swing states which really matter. Harris is leading in Michigan and Wisconsin, Trump in Nevada, Georgia and Arizona, but these are razor-thin margins. Harris and Trump are tied in Pennsylvania according to some polls. The Trump campaign and the Republicans are clearly worried about women voters who overwhelmingly support Kamala Harris. Early voting data shows women have outnumbered men in key swing states in voting. The widening gender gap is a big alarm for Republicans. Addressing a campaign rally, Trump left a dark message saying that uh, he shouldn't have left the White House after losing in 2020. The Republican also said he didn't mind if someone had to shoot through the fake news to get to him. Kamala Harris, on the other hand, has been appealing to voters saying they must act in order to decide the fate of their nation. Hey, thank you for watching this on CNBC TV 18. Hope you liked it. For more such interesting news and updates, follow CNBC TV 18 on all the social media platforms.